Mm. What's up, people? I won't tell you where I'm at. I'm just going to tell you that it's been a very, very, very long week. Super long. Extra, 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 extra long. So I'll share with you what I was, uh, I'm looking all kind of, I don't know if you can't even see it to be honest with you. So I was diagnosed yesterday with a, I can't even say it to be honest with you. It's a pterygium, I guess. And it's like where you have a growth that is in your eye and it like grows over and can like mess with your vision or whatever. I had a good friend of mine that also told me that it may possibly be some iritis is if what i'm saying correctly so it's inflammation of the iris and you have like a blood vessel that inflames and it's probably more than likely from stress which makes sense you know when you're stressed out like the craziest shit happens to you i swear the craziest shit happens to you so anyways i got all this cool stuff happening to me because i'm stressed out but yeah i'm here with my fam Everybody say hi to Peter. Say hi, Peter. Hi. My name's Peter. Stop doing this on the live. You told me you were going to go live and give you a line. So say hi. You never said that. Yes, I did. You liar. No. She's a liar. No. Yes, she is. No. Say hi. It's your mommy baby. <laughs> Anyways. The rest of this week should be really good. We've got Mrs. Donna's event coming up on Saturday. Um, we're gonna be at Nichols Saturday night, and I don't know. It's been it's been a long ass week. I'm not gonna lie. I'd be lying to you if I was like everything's perfect, but it's like that every week. So I mean, what's new, right? Um. Anyways, everybody wants to say hi to John too. He probably is like pissed. I'm gonna bring you guys in there. You say hi on live. Hi. Hello. Say hi. How's everybody doing out there? <laughs> Thursday night. How you guys doing? Angie, I love your mom. She's awesome. Katie Clawson, what up? What up, what up? Mike Herzog. Jay Jacobs. Oh, Jay Jacobs. What's up, dude? So we're just having some quality time, and uh, it's been a long week, so we just want to try to take some stress relievers this weekend and relax for a minute. And, you know, I'm going to tag Julie in this video because Julie from Lowo is the one that does all my lashes. And Julie, I need my lashes done. I, I usually get them done weekly. I didn't get to get them done this week. I put it off because of my little eye thing that I got going on. But Julie, man, I really need my eyes. Like, it's looking kind of, so it's kind of scarce on the right side here. And um, it's totally not your fault. It's mine from rubbing my eye and sleeping on my right side. So, you know, I don't look cute when I'm, like, lopsided on my eyes. It's, it's just not, not a good look for me. So, um, Lowo, I need you to fix my face, okay? I'll be seeing you Tuesday to fix my eyes. I don't care what infections or what kind of things I got going on my eyes and inflammatory vessels. And I don't care. I want my lashes. I'm definitely tagging you in this video. <laughs> She's gonna kill me. What's up, Jason? How are you guys? Anyways, I told you guys I was gonna have a super, super, super stressful day yesterday, which my day was super, super, super stressful, but it ended up being pretty damn good. I'll just leave it like that. Not everybody needs to know all my business, so if you know, you know, and if you don't, you don't. So it is what it is, but I do want to let you guys know that it was a good day overall. Um, what's up, Jeff? My gallbladder seems to be intact still. Um, I did clean up my diet just a little bit, and uh, hopefully it's not like... I'm telling you guys, like, stress is crazy. Stress does the craziest things to you. You know, it's... Uh... <laughs> You guys ever seen the floss? It, with, come on, with the floss? <laughs> how do you do that? Is that how you do it? What, the, backpack dance. the backpack dance floss? Is that what you call it? No, it's just a floss. Can they see you? No. <laughs> Can they see they you now? They can't see my head. They can that? They can't see all me. <laughs> you guys see what I'm going to deal with. <laughs> anyways. um. So anyways, yes. We shall have a great weekend. We shall try to rejuvenate just a little bit. 
Um, we do have something cool coming out. I will say this. I want to try it myself before I like rave about it because I have not tried it and I don't ever, ever talk about something until I try it. So it's called Cupid's Candy. Cupid's Candy. Valentine's Day is coming up. Um, so what's in Cupid's Candy again? PT. PT-141. PT-141. And what does PT-141 do? PT-141 is a libido enhancer for males and females. And it's really cool because it's not like like Viagra or Cialis. It actually works on the vascular. It doesn't work on the vascular system like Viagra and Cialis do. It actually works on the nervous system. And what it does is to, to get you feeling that libido function. Jeff knows. It, it, <laughs> Jeff it, knows. Uh, it, cre it creates more dopamine. And we know that dopamine is that, that, that feel-good, you know, sensation. Makes you so, happy. Yeah, so it's really good. Now, the best thing about <laughs> it is, is you can do BT-141 by itself with us, right? Or for an increased effect and better stimulation, you can do the PT-141 with oxytocin and the Tadalafil. <laughs> So at that AKA point, Cialis. yeah, it's really, really good stuff. Yeah, um, ladies, so, every, every lady needs it, a libido enhancer, right? I mean, we were just talking today. There was, um, a, one of our patients, you'd be surprised how many females come to us and they have something called vaginal dryness. I know all of you guys are like, oh my God, I can't believe she's seriously talking about this, but that's a real problem. So, I mean, when your hormones are jacked and you don't have the right amount of hormones that you should have, I mean, you have just like guys guys have erectile issues right like you know, you can't get it up or whatever can't keep it up um for whatever reason that might be i mean then you know you've got uh you got females that have a lack of estrogen and that's what it is people that are going through menopause and they got vaginal dryness and then intercourse or any sort of sexual type of activity doesn't feel good Okay, so anyway, it's very important that your hormones are in check. I actually just had my blood work done myself. Everything came back good, minus my white blood cell count. Um, I think everything else came back good, right? Uh, they, yeah, <laughs> everything was good. My testosterone was still high at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So my testosterone was at a 40 on a scale that caps out at 48 at 4 o'clock in the afternoon, and my testosterone's the highest in the morning. So I probably wake up with the, my testosterone somewhere around a hundred. That's with no replacement or anything. That's no true. replacement. Me just being aggressive all the time, right? That's right. <laughs> What's up, Jody? Oxytocin is great for both. It is. You know, Jeff. Hi, mom. Um, you know, Jeff. They actually use that in uh, London or England, I believe. What? For like relationship, um, it's easy here. They use it to bring down your barriers, so you can actually speak to one another without yeah, it's emotions called, it's called, it, coming yeah, into play. What it does Love is, you too, Michelle. Hi, Jody. <laughs> Couple therapy, yes. Yeah. See exactly. That's exactly what it does. So it brings down your oh your inhibitions. inhibitions. Get off! I said that before you. Yeah, copycat <laughs> anyways yes it's for couples therapy they use it for that they used to use mdma i believe for couples therapy back in the day yeah. which is ecstasy in plain english for you people out there that don't know that um paulina hi oh my god listen paulina i was literally just watching your video i'm like damn it i gotta do my live and um you uh encouraged me to do my live tonight even though i'm really tired and didn't want to do it Congratulations on your new venture, and I wish you the best of luck. Ron, hello, how are you? Won't get arrested like, yeah, I know, yeah. Oxytocin won't let you get arrested, I guess. You know, you won't do crazy things. <laughs> Paulina says hi. Hey. <laughs> so I only wish you the best of luck, girl. I know you're gonna rock it. You're a workaholic like myself, and uh, you know, we can't do anything but succeed, right? So that's what we do is we just do what we need to do to make things right and make sure that things go well and we succeed at what we do. Anyways, I'm literally looking at my lashes right now. It's bothering me. So I need to get off because it's really bothering me. Um, and I can't take it anymore until I get my lashes fixed by Julie. I am going to tag you in this video so you can laugh all the way to Tuesday. 
when I see you Tuesday to fix my lashes. Everybody wish me the best of luck with my eye drops and my uh, prednisone drops um, for my eye and hope that I don't have to get eye surgery from this wonderful piece of film growing over my right eye. It's awesome. Um, so everybody stay stress free and have a wonderful Thursday night. And I hope everybody's got a great weekend coming up. And John says hello and bye. Bye, guys. You guys are in Tampa. I'll see you Saturday. Where? I'll see you at the Lux Fashion Show at the Godfrey Hotel. It's a pre-Super Bowl party. Titan will be there in full effect. Me and Teresa will be there. We'll have a cabana there. A lot of people will be there, so come out and join us. It'll be awesome. Then I'll be on stage at Nickel Blair. Make sure my stage ready for me. Okay. Anyways, I will tag Blair and Julie in this so they can make sure that everything is ready for me in the next couple days. And I'll talk to you guys soon.